So I guess implanting an ESP chip in a hamster and teaching them karate isn't a good idea. I just gave him a carrot. Hopefully that'll keep him busy. I'm gonna shove this stylus up your pie hole, buddy. <laughs> Kung Fu Cyborg Hamster. Hey guys, this is Creasy with Arduino for Noobs and I'm going to show you today how to install Arduino IDE on a Raspberry Pi. So it's going to be real short and simple. I have a Pro Micro plugged into the Raspberry Pi and we're going to do a little test to make sure it's working after it's installed. But first you're going to want to, I'm connected remotely, so you're going to want to bring up a terminal window, okay? And I'll show you what to type. So you're going to type sudo apt-get install Arduino. And now that we have that typed in, I'll hit enter. And as you can see, it's checking and grabbing the packages. Do you want to continue? Hit Y, because yes, you do want to continue. Unless you're chickening out, then don't continue. Now it'll continue with the process. Preparing, unpacking yada 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 and you'll know it's done because the command prompt will come back so this might take a while so I'll jump to when it's done alright it's done and now you should be back at the command prompt and now that that part is done I'll show you what to do next once you saw the command prompt you can close that terminal window uh, come down here to the raspberry and we'll go to electronics and I'm going to right click it first and add to desktop so now we have a quick shortcut right here easy ready to go also you're gonna wanna reboot it so we'll make sure everything's installed right and gets a fresh start so hit reboot your Raspberry Pi would start up again and I'll bring it back when it's done okay now that the Pi is booted back up we will go to the icon and give it a click. Now it should look exactly like it should on your PC or Mac. Uh, we'll go to tools and board. Seems to already be on the Leonardo. We'll check the port. It's on the port. Now remember it's, it's plugged into the Raspberry Pi so this is all being done from the Pi. Um, next I'll type out some simple code and show it to you and we'll test out the connection here and make sure it's uploading. So give me a second, let me hack some code up. Alright, here's a little something I came up with. Um, it's going to begin the keyboard at setup. The loop is going to wait two seconds, give me enough time to unplug it after I upload it. And when I plug it back into something two seconds later, it's going to print onto the screen through typing we installed Arduino IDE and it worked so now that my board set up and the port set up we'll hit upload and as you can see it's uploading and it's connected to the Pi and it's uploading to my Pro Micro board now the upload's done so now we'll test out the Pro Micro and make sure that this actually worked so now I have a text editor open. I have the Pro Micro here in my hand, and I'm about to plug it into the laptop. And let's see what happens. It worked. It worked. So you can upload code from your Raspberry Pi right to your Arduino. And as you can see, you can also do it remotely through a, a laptop or PC. So now that it works, up download all my github code and put it on your pie and start uploading it to your devices i hope this helped you guys it was trying to make it as simple as as i could it was a simple video so um but an important one so now you can do stuff on the go with your pie also so i hope you enjoyed and like subscribe comment share message me i, I love helping you guys so thanks for the feedback see ya